it's a great day to be out riding a bike. We have mostly clear skies. Temperatures are comfortable and the humidity pleasant. That is all going to change, though, by the time we get to tomorrow. We'll already start to notice the humidity increasing, eventually leading to some thunderstorms by Tuesday for the rest of the week. Right now, a live look, though, outside in Annapolis. Beautiful. It is crystal clear temperature wise in Annapolis, the lower 80s, 83 in Middle River, parked in here at 77 degrees and 80 in Westminster. If you have relatives in the south, this is the time to call them up and say, don't you want to move to Maryland? Because they're dealing with the baking heat. In fact, excessive heat warnings are up uh, for parts of, you can see Oklahoma City at 101, stretching all the way out over toward Atlanta, 94 degrees. Here's the bad news. That heat it is coming up to us. No longer are we talking about the 80s. We are flirting with the 90 degree mark for quite a few days as this area of high pressure now begins to nudge a little bit further uh, out over to our east and our winds around it are going to rotate clockwise. So for today and over the weekend, they've predominantly been out of the north. They've been slightly mild, a little bit cooler, a little bit drier. Not the case for tomorrow. When you follow that clockwise flow, our winds tomorrow come in out of the south. They pull in all of that heat. They also pump in more moisture. So we are talking about high humidity from Monday all the way through Sunday. This sticky air is going to be in place. The threat of thunderstorms vary, I'd say, between about a 20 to 60% chance though, throughout the week. Monday, though, even though it's sticky, it's not going to be humid enough to breed any thunderstorms. That's the good news, just dealing with the mix of clouds out there as your skin sort of gets used to the stickiness again. Once we get to Tuesday around 3.30, now you can see pockets of showers beginning to build. This is the day, the best day we have the threat of severe weather. I think, if anything, it's going to come into the later evening hours, 10 o'clock, all the way through around 11 30 p.m. You can see that area shaded in yellow. Annapolis down to Shadyside, pushing out over towards Centerville. This is where you have the threat for the strongest storms. Yet again, the main threat going to be some of those gusty winds, although we keep the chance of rain at least through Friday and then drop it down to 20 to 30 percent through the weekend. So for tonight, before that rain gets here, we're looking at clear skies. No complaints out there weather-wise. 67 degrees in the Inner Harbor, 62 in Park. And this is nice maybe to have a mild cup of hot chocolate while you do a little bit of stargazing sitting on your front porch. Tomorrow, the mix of sun and clouds out there, although increasing the humidity, it will feel closer to the lower 90s. 88 degrees in the Inner Harbor, Parkton going for 83, Annapolis 81, and Chestertown at about 84. With the humidity tomorrow, though, it's going to feel like 92 degrees. Look what happens Tuesday, though. The humidity, it's like gets on a trampoline and jumps sky high. We are now feeling like 101 degrees. A heat advisory may be issued for Tuesday. Wednesday, the humidity stays around as well, although temperature is starting to fall slightly. Still feeling like the upper 90s. We have a cold front on through Wednesday, but it's not going to do much, just keeping that rain chance in the area. So you see Monday, the mix of sun and clouds staying dry. Tuesday, the threat of severe storms. Look at the storm chance, though, all the way through Thursday. It's on the high side. When that front begins to wash out on Friday, we drop the rain chance to about 20% for you, although we don't completely take it out of the area all the way through the weekend as temperatures really stay on into the upper 80s, feeling though a lot toaster, maybe like two or three degrees warmer than what the actual reading is. That's a look at your seven day forecast. Mallory, over to you.